Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem. So here we have a 2 to the power of m equals to m to the power of 32 and we solve this problem for the values of m. So here in this problem, we, we our first target is to move all the variable terms to the right hand side and we move the constant terms in the left hand side. So first we move the variable term to the right hand side. For this we need to eliminate uh, uh, this uh, m from left hand side in order to eliminate this m we will take the mth root on both of the sides it will be written as 2 to the power of m and its whole power is 1 over m equals to m to the power of 32 and its whole power is 1 over m and after this step we will apply here the exponent law you know that if you have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n so according to this exponent law we will multiply these two exponents and it will be written as 2 to the power of m multiplied by 1 over m equals to m to the power of 32 multiplied by 1 over m this m is cancelled out by this m and it will be written as 2 is equals to here we move this 1 over m inside the term and it will be written as m to the power of 1 over m and its whole power is 32. Here we back apply this exponent line we move this m inside the term okay. According to this we write this term. So further uh, in the next step here we need uh, to move this 32 to the left hand side so that in order to move this 32 in the left hand side we need to take the 32th root on both of the sides. Uh, for this we will take uh, 1 over 32 power on both of the sides. So it will be written as m to the power of 1 over m and its whole power is 32 and its 32th root. So further uh, you see here we have exponent again we have exponent to the exponent so these are multiplied by each other so this 32 is cancelled out by this 32 and uh, we will obtain here 2 to the power of 1 over 32 equals to m to the power of 1 over m. So here uh, if you focus uh, in the right hand side you see here we have the exponent of this term is the uh, reciprocal of its base so that we will make this type of condition in the left hand side so that in order to make this type of condition in the left hand side uh, we will rewrite our left hand side as so uh, for make this condition we need to uh, multiply uh, the uh, exponent of 2 by 2 and divide by 2 also so we write it as 2 to the power of 2 over 2 multiplied by 1 over 32 equals to m to the power of 1 over m so now you see here uh, we have uh, we move this 2 inside the term and we multiply this 2 with 32 it will be written as 2 square and its whole power is 1 over 2 multiplied by 32 equals to m to the power of 1 over m so further in the next step uh, here uh, we need some simplifications and we have this 2 square becomes 4 and this 2 times of 32 equals to 64 and this whole equals to m to the power of 1 over m so now in the next step uh, we again uh, we can uh, just repeat this process again and again uh, when uh, after that uh, until we will get the exponent be the reciprocal of its base okay so here we we can just repeat this process again and again so again we multiply the exponent of 4 and divide by 2 so it will be written as 2 over 2 into 1 over 64 equals to m to the power of 1 over m so we again here we move this 2 inside the term and it will be written as 4 square and we multiply this 2 with uh, 2 times of 64 it is equals to m to the power of 1 over m. So that here uh, we know about 4 square equals to 16 and its exponent is 1 over 2 times of 64 equals to 128 equals to m to the power of 1 over m. 
you see here uh, we cannot get uh, the exponent be the reciprocal of its base it means that we repeat this process again and now again we multiply and divide the exponent of 16 by 2 it will be written as 2 over 2 multiplied by 1 over 128 equals to m to the power of 1 over m so here again we move this 2 inside the term so it will become 16 square and its whole exponent is 1 over 2 times of 128 equals to m to the power of 1 over m so here uh, we first multiply these two terms 2 times of 128 you see that 2 times of 128 equals to 2 8 is a 16 we write 6 and carry 1 2 2 is a 4 4 plus 1 is 5 and 2 1 is a 2 2 times of 128 equals to 256 so here we need to find 16 square so 16 square means that we multiply 16 with 16 and here uh, we will break this 16 as 10 plus 6 and now we multiply 16 with 10 becomes 160 and when you multiply 16 with 6 you return as 6 6 is 36 we write 6 and carry 3 6 1 is 6 6 plus 3 becomes 9 so we add these values 0 plus 6 equals to 6 9 plus 6 plus 9 becomes 15 we write 5 and carry 1 1 plus 1 is 2 so it means that 16 square is also equals to 256 so now here we move backward and we substitute uh, the value of uh, 2 times of 128 this value and this value these two values we put in this equation so after substituting these values we will uh, get our uh, above equation as uh, 16 square uh, is equal 16 square equals to 256 to the exponent of 1 over 256 equals to m to the power of 1 over m and now you see here uh, we will get uh, the exponent is the reciprocal of its base so now here we have time to compare both of the sides so if you compare the bases we get our m equals to 256 and when you compare the exponents then you get 1 over m equals to 1 over 256 so uh, here uh, we will just uh, if, if you can focus both of these cases you get the same value of m and it is 256 so this is the final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.